Hi Aquarius, it's Elle here to do your daily reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Aquarius with the clear concise message from you okay so the first card out aquarius is home so this card talks about truly feeling like yourself being in the energy of acceptance truly accepting you this card also talks about home is where the heart is it could be with a particular person in a particular relationship this could even be moving back home or back home to um you know a, a city state town something about home where you feel comfortable is your home again home is where the heart is um you've gained some independence away from what you deem is home but you could be going backwards okay you could be connecting backwards right and somebody feels like home with you or you've or you feel like uh you feel at home with them or it could be mutual so let's see what's going on around you aquarius um yeah let's see what's going on around you uh, so that could be like um, a group of people. Uh, it could be something like gang stalking, a group of people talking about you, um, concerned about you, uh, gossiping about you, wanting to know what's going on with you. Um, these people, I don't think you're close to them. Yeah, you're not close to them. Oh, I was about to say it. It came out off camera and it just came out. Mean Girl Club. It, so it could be a group of women. It could be a group of, you know, a mixture of men and women. It's a group of people who do not like you, but they're concerned about you and concerned about what you're doing. It's the most asinine thing because it's like you are even concerned with these people. And they talk about you, um, what you're doing in life, where you are, who you talk to, who you're with. They are stalking you. They are looking in on you, okay? Especially if you have social media. Let's see what's going on here, Aquarius. So, okay, this could be like a coven. Black Witch is coming out. Or these people just have ill intentions for you. Like, you know, they want to curse you. They're they're wicked. They're bad. Um, nothing about them is good. Uh, they see you shining, Aquarius. Flashy as F, okay? So they see you... Um, okay, they see you coming up. If you have been kind of covert to yourself, you know, behind the scenes and now you're showing off a little bit or some people hear about what you're doing by word of mouth by other people, these people are now, you know, it has sparked their interest. So they're snooping around. They're talking about you. They're holding conversations. Do your energy and your protection work, Aquarius. Um... This also could even just be somebody who's dealing with someone that you used to deal with, or this could even be an energy of, yeah, there's a particular female ganging up or getting people to um, kind of like gang up on you uh, or get, she's like recruiting people, recruiting people to be on her side against you for whatever reason. This could even be friends that you left. This could be, um, again, you know, a love partner or somebody that you don't even deal with anymore. Uh, this could even be uh, family members. Um, it's a, just a, a group of, I heard like gossipy women, gossipy people. Uh, let's see what's going on here. What is going on around the Aquarius? All right, let's see. Wow, yeah. Talks too much. So these people talk too much. They blah, blah, blah. There's somebody also telling your business that they're talking about you or... Um, yeah, it could definitely be a friend. People are wondering what you're doing, how you're doing it. Um, they didn't know that you would be doing so well. Okay. Yeah. You're completely opposite of them. You know, you get the, you're the white witch. Okay. Um, somebody is just not smart enough to deal with you. Aquarius an intellectual and an idiot. It could be the other way around. These people made some, some uh, very questionable decisions in their life, okay? And now they can even be wanting to reach out to you for help. They see that you, or they know that you're very smart, um, that you can think your way out of stuff. Um, maybe this is what you used to help these people with or this particular person with when you were in communication with them. They could always bounce ideas off of you. They could always get, um, 
yeah, maybe a good idea. Let's see what else is going on here around you, Aquarius. What is okay? Oh, this flipped out. So Aquarius, you could be having some vivid dreams. It's like maybe your dreams are trying to tell you that something is going on. Something is about to happen. Um, write your dreams down, Aquarius, and then kind of compile them and then go back over them and see where you can kind of make sense of them. Because it's like you're getting bits and pieces of a story. A whole lot of money is coming to you, Aquarius. Uh, maybe this is one of the dreams that you have, okay? Um Maybe this is what you're manifesting. And this is why people are coming out of the woodwork in terms of you. People you haven't heard from, people you don't talk to. Uh, they're looking in on you, asking about you, talking about you. Uh, they want to just know. You know, maybe even so they can know to sabotage. Uh, let's see. What should Aquarius know about these people, this person? Let's see. What should Aquarius know about? Um, oh, okay, they blocked on all social media. So these are some people that you have blocked. You got them on a block list already because you already know what they're about. They're about drama. They're about looking in on your life to see how they can mess it up or talk against you. They understand energy work to a certain degree. Some of them, they understand it fully, especially with Black Witch coming out. They see that you're a spoiled, pampered wife. Or if you're not a wife, then you spoil and pamper yourself where the universe is spoiling you and pampering you. Um, Aquarius, you got some people, they can smell the, okay, I heard you, they can smell the blood in the water. It's like sharks, you know what I'm saying? It's like they, they know that you're coming into a whole lot of money, abundance. They know that a lot is going on for you, that you're about to come into a season of, uh, relaxation, um, uh, manifestation of your dreams. These people want to, um, be front center, front and center. Uh, some of the, okay, so some of you need to let these people, you know, have a, a taste of this because, um, the universe is making you definitely, definitely, uh, making, uh, your enemies, your footstool. And also the universe is preparing a table, uh, before you in the presence of your enemies. Okay. So it's about them seeing what God spirit universe has done is doing for you. So they need to know, uh, they will know, uh, is what I heard. All right, let's see. Uh, what else is going on around Aquarius? When, uh, some people are losing things they're losing homes. Um, things are falling apart for them. Maybe this is what they wished upon you. There's an energy, a heavy energy of, yeah, somebody could be using drugs, uh, abusing drugs, could be you, Aquarius, could be someone else. Someone needs to seek help, okay? Somebody is, you know, a prostitute, or this is what, this is who they were dealing with, a, a prostitute, okay? Um, this is, so if you're dealing with somebody, um, This is somebody that you don't even talk to and they went on and moved on away from you and they moved on to somebody who was just loose. They are effing prostitute and this person has infertility issues. Uh, they could be mad at you because you have a child or you have children. Um, this also could be an energy of if it's not like, um, you know, in, infertility in, in terms of uh, not being able to produce child or get pregnant it's infertility in terms of the this person can't make anything grow in their life their relationship their hair anything they can't make it grow honey um this person is completely closed off to love uh this is a black heart black soul whomever you're dealing with yeah somebody is losing their house they're losing everything all because they wish this on you they need to get some spiritual awareness spiritual awareness get some they're lying to everyone about what's happening uh, for them going on around them. They also are lying to everyone about you, Aquarius. All right, let's see. What else should Aquarius know? What else should Aquarius know? All right, let's see. What else should Aquarius know moving forward? We're going to pull from a few other decks too. Let's see. What else should Aquarius know? So someone thinks you're absolutely smart. They love you for that. Um, it's somebody that maybe you, you, you break up with and then you make up, you know, this whole sex thing, you know, the toxicity of it. This person could want to travel with you. Um, if it's your boyfriend or girlfriend, whomever this is, if it feels like an energy where you're separated and they're lovesick over you, they can't even get out of bed. They want to take you on a weekend getaway and maybe even propose marriage to you, secret plans to propose. Um, they're weighing up their options right now. I'm trying to figure out what they should do. Yeah. 
this person could be talking to their friends about what they should do next but i don't know if their friends give real advice um what else in, in terms of this deck what should aquarius know what else do we have for aquarius all right so aquarius you got some spoiled rotten children or a child that could be a physical fight Ooh, aquarius i'm hoping that it doesn't involve you um or your children or anything of that nature um Oh, I just heard somebody is ready to physically fight over you. Ooh, Aquarius. This might have been somebody who didn't value anything, period. You know, they didn't value you. And now it's like they're just ready to fight. Somebody's also jealous of your children. You can try to pick a fight with your child or children. Let's see who Aquarius is dealing with. What is the energy around Aquarius? What is the energy around Aquarius in terms of person? Okay. So, yeah, we got a man here in deep concern. You could be separated from this person. They're kind of slipping into this depression. They can't, they're sick over not talking to you, not being around you. Um, every time you leave, you take the sunshine with you, Aquarius. This person wants to come to you. They're concerned about what they should do, how they should, um, you know, how they, how they can reach out to you. It, it, this could be the same person could be a different man wealthy man so some wealthy man is concerned about you do you have another lover do you still love them or you know do you realize that they're your person that they want to be with you yeah you aren't their girlfriend or you aren't their significant other right now i don't think there's a title change happening this person doesn't like that you left them out in the cold they also feel like you have somebody else. You're dealing with somebody else. You don't want them. You don't view them that way. Yeah, main male. So they feel like you're already in a relationship or you got somebody else on the side here. Maybe somebody that you're not even, you know, in a full on relationship. Whomever this is, they see great fortune with you or somebody sees dollar signs in your eyes, Aquarius. Um, yeah, courthouse, petty, pesky energy. Something about paperwork also to make some quick, fast change. So paperwork gets pushed, move forward, approval, yes, answer, or you do the paperwork, you go and get name change, passport, whenever, uh, file this paper, go do this, do that. And then you're able to move. This could even be like filling out application to move, move residence. It looks like it's a yes. Okay. This card's wanted to come out. Wow. Yep. It's a, it's a yes. Aquarius. Um, it's what you've been hoping and wishing for 35 36 it's going to come in order um this new path is going to open up to you so you're going to be able to do something you want to do move away dreams wishes hopes uh will be fulfilled you're expecting this you're in the energy of expectation here so aquarius it just looks really really good for you the energy around you is that somebody really wants to be with you or they feel like you're the num their number one you're their lover you're the person you're their soulmate you're the perfect ideal person but there is separation here for whatever reason it's almost as if somebody needs to get something right or they need to do something right they need to uh, come at you the correct way it's like this person is not um stepping up to the plate it's almost as if they want you to do the energy work they want you to do all the work and then they will kind of show themselves i don't know it's 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 reading a little backwards for me uh, let's see what's going on. Uh, is there a person who wants to talk to Aquarius? What does this person want to say? What does this person want to say to Aquarius? What is this particular person that Aquarius is separated from? What do they want to say to? Him? Okay, theatrics. So they feel like you you're putting on the theatrics. They feel like you aren't serious, or maybe you cutting them off, or or asking them not to talk to you, or blocking you. Um, or blocking them is just theatrics christmas christmas could be significant will be significant it was significant maybe the past christmas um okay so we got divorcing and reversing one to fall out in reverse i was going to turn it up right so somebody is not letting this go they're not divorcing the idea of or someone is not divorcing or someone is not divorced just yet and we did have that court card coming out where it's like paperwork needs to be filed done approved and whatnot rational somebody's trying to make a rational decision or someone wants to be more rational in terms of dealing with you aquarius or they want you to be more rational a lot of green cards here so somebody wants growth and healing with the christmas card uh let's see 
what is going on? What does this person want to say to Aquarius? This person wants to trying to save my marriage. Okay, so um this could either this could be read either way this person is not divorced or not divorcing yet and they're trying to save their marriage or there's somebody who wants to be in a relationship with you and they're not letting you go and they want to save this relationship or this marriage or whatever this is um maternity this person might even want to get you pregnant or they see you as the perfect person uh to be a mother okay uh, someone could have gotten someone else pregnant also complacent somebody stuck on you you know they can't see anything else they can't see anybody else it is what it is with you um even if they walk away yeah they want to be honest somebody wants to be honest um somebody wants to be honest let me they told me to put that one back let's see what is this about someone needs to be honest someone's not telling yeah okay so somebody wants to be honest about reconciling with you even though there has been weeks of no communication um yes yes answer they want you to say yes this person you've been dealing with them for a very long time with the gray hair card drunk wants to just come out right we'll talk about it you've been dealing with this person for a very long time or this person could be older than you this person is giving you gray hair okay yeah because maybe they wanted to be friends with benefits they want to have some drunk sex with you and now they want to turn it into legacy somebody has sex with you and they got you pregnant on purpose okay that's for some of you some of you um you got pregnant on purpose this is what i just heard also some of you it started out as friends with benefits and just having fun and drunk sex and this and that and now somebody wants a life with you somebody is like we need to celebrate our anniversary of knowing each other or someone is saying it's been too long that we've been doing this Somebody feels like the other person is live wire. They don't know what they're going to get at times. And so somebody is ghosting this situation while the other person is still studying it, still watching it, still stuck. Wow. Um, what else is going on here for Aquarius? Yeah, somebody's miserable in this house or this relationship. Whatever you know to be, whatever you know about this person is true. Um, they know that you're loving or they want to be loving or more loving kind to you is what i'm getting last cards for aquarius um what is this okay as i said that hard-headed somebody's hard-headed you you didn't get it the first time and you just you know business so somebody's saying you hard-headed this person came in to disturb you stay focused on your business finish this up somebody says a liar altogether and a thug something you don't know uh resourceful is coming in in the reverse somebody is don't even have resources here the cards want you to know that either you or the other person has not healed yet the promises that they make i don't know they make them while they're drunk or they say anything they make promises because it sounds good by next week you could hear from them or they could ghost you and not be there for you yep because the separation is coming out this person is just an overall low life okay and they're unkind and that's the only way they know how to be and they have a lot of different um secret affairs that they're hiding from you they are absolutely broken okay and i don't know if you can fix them they're all talk and no action okay and like i said when you leave uh, you take the sunshine with you Aquarius they want to dominate you domination they just want to win if it sounds like a lie Aquarius guess what it's probably a lie you need to tell this person text me don't call me yeah they're missing you but so what you need to come to an understanding about this that this person has either a mental illness or a physical one this person likes to throw magic around okay and the magic could be just what they do the smoke in the mirrors the lying the deceptive nature the taking you out and wooing you and then next by next week they're ghosting you let's see where aquarius should be where's aquarius going or what should aquarius be focused on with the butterfly oracle cards what should aquarius be focused on? okay aquarius new exercise program this is also a new idea coming to you is this exercise get the blood flowing pumping because the new idea can come to you also i'm um, just like the universe is going to be able to speak to you once you get to a place of um you, prana is what i heard you know, that life force in you or you you're breathing breathing deeply take the next step now there's something that you need to be doing we did have an energy of the universe saying focus finish up your business 
you know, uh, unfinished business, but finish it up. Hobbies, Aquarius, you may have a hobby. Uh, you may do very well at it. It says you need to monetize it. Be true to you. We talked about that with the home card coming out, really resting in the energy of accepting you for you and not trying to shift, change, um, man manipulate yourself to fit in and all that stuff. You just show up as you, it, what they see is what they get, right? Um, get some rest. You are sleeping, but you're not resting. Your mind is not, you know, in inertia. The universe put you in this place where you're good, maybe financially, so that you can rest. You've done a lot. Relationship dynamics. You feel differently about a relationship. Therefore, the dynamic is different. Or the dynamic is different in terms of it used to be three and now there's two. Um, somebody got rid of someone now they want you or it used to be two and now there's three you know something like that it, the cards want you to know you are stronger than you know than you give yourself credit for Aquarius join in join in a group of people not virtually but a group of people wherever you are uh, that share your same interest that can help you cope heal um, this could even be AA uh, you know um, narco narcotics uh, anonymous wow I just got dizzy saying that some of you are high out of your mind. Okay. Um, we're going to leave that right there. Uh, finances. Don't all, all of, automatically assume that finances are bad because this card could indicate that they are good or you need to put yourself on a budget or you need to look over your finances or you can start a new business and you need to have an adequate amount of finances. So finances are just center stage here. Um, let's pull some tarot and then we'll get out of here. Woo. Some of you are. Mm. What's going on here? Okay, we got the deck upside down. That's what's going on. The three of pentacles and the six of cups. All right, so somebody does want to work on something. Someone from your past. You're trying to connect backwards. They saw that working with you was a good deal. It was a good idea. This could even be friend group. Like they want to know what you're doing. This could be somebody from your past in terms of friends. Someone you grew up with. You're really young. They could be looking in on you. Asking about you. Because you, you're focused on you. Your your cup is closed. Your emotions are for you and you, and you only. Um, you're not giving anything out. But you, you're able to receive. You're able to give best advice. Um, there's so many different facets of you Aquarius therefore you have to protect your energy says the Queen of Cups in a practice emotional stability the Ace of Cups says you're getting something new uh, new insight new spirituality learning something new about spirituality um, little droplets you know coming to you little droplets of inspiration this is also a new home for some of you um, this looks so good Aquarius Wow. Yeah, you have lots of protection. If you feel like, okay, these people stalking me, gang stalking me, all this stuff, asking around about me, you have um, an adequate amount of protection. Okay. This, um, so you have, you know, you, you are protected. Um, fret not is what I heard. Okay. All right. Yeah. What you don't see is good for you. You don't need to know it. It's all right. Um, it says the universe. Let's put these cards back in here and let's keep shuffling. What do we have to tell Aquarius moving forward? What do we have to tell Aquarius? Okay. Yeah, the Hierophant. Pick up a book, learn, study, um, show yourself approved, put yourself on some type of routine, regimen, have some law and order about yourself. Your day should be structured, or your days should be structured. Um, more days should be structured you know, then more days without structure, you know, not to say you can't ever do what you want to do on any day, but you need to have some type of uh, routine, um, status quo. Yeah. You need to have some status quo for yourself. Um, learning something, governance, govern yourself accordingly. You could work for a large entity a company. You're learning something. So this is like orientation sitting before people and they telling you how things work or how it's going to go. Um, yeah let's see what else the three of swords so you gotta sever ties with something else or somebody else it's bittersweet at the same time it's like you, you're done you gotta isolate something alienate it move on um maybe even your heart here something about healing needed to heal what is this three of swords the death card so it could be the end of a relationship or the end of heartbreak the end of heartache heartbreak um the end of miscommunication misrepresentation not getting it not talking yeah, somebody wants to reach out and, um, sorry, make something right uh, with you, for you, Aquarius. Could be a king of pentacles. We did have that wealthy man showing up. 
it's like they want to show you their love by way of gifting you something giving you something trips money gifts this is somebody who's not real romantic but they're very practical very uh, mathematical methodical also um, they give good advice in terms of business and how to grow and make things grow yeah the two of wands they don't want to come towards you um, they saw that the grass maybe wasn't so much greener on the other side or they're seeing that the grass is greener with you Aquarius or they're realizing that the grass is green where you water it maybe they want to give you some time some effort they're not sure about this decision and neither are you because it, either there has been karma karmic situation between the two of you yep it's just a level of distrust between the two of you but it's like they want to come to you and date you take you out to the theater uh to the movies to where do people go um can you tell i haven't been anywhere so <laughs> they want to take you out they want to just court you um food drink hanging out whatever people do uh, with the strength card but they're also holding back because they have a lot of you know reservation feelings for you they're not sure there's some level of distrust or mistrust here maybe you put your trust in them it didn't work out they put their trust in you i don't know it could even be from the past there's an energy of needing to forgive one another like move forward and forgive like completely forgive um there's also an energy of somebody's needing to tame themselves there's a level of emotional um you know somebody's an emotionally intellectual or intellectually emotional or something like that like somebody has really achieved a high level of emotional intellect like they understand emotions when to when not to they just know how to govern themselves accordingly could be you could be the other person could be the both of you trying to figure this out the high priest is here so aquarius and we talked about this maybe you're not talking to this person there is separation you're not giving them your energy your time and it's making you only you know even more desirable you know to this person or these people unattainable somebody's talking about your gifts your talents uh your intuition your intuitive nature um they're, they're talking about how much you know uh how you're very secretive you could be you know answering questions with questions you're just elusive right now um you're a threat to all women your sex appeal just by nature threatens women with the high priestess showing up it's a decision that needs to be made here maybe in love in some partnership you're in the precipice of something you're in the stage of um being pregnant with gestation period something's you about to birth something the universe is preparing you yep the full card okay this is not ready so you're not ready but this is what's coming they got to get you ready because this is what's coming also aquarius a high level of jealousy backbiting and people just trying to take you out and take you down um maybe even sacrifice or a fight we have physical fights somebody wants to fight you this is wow yeah that's crazy wow <laughs> they gonna this person these people gonna want to take you down just because um you know you are the star car people look up to you your uh, chakras are in, in alignment you help other people you guide people you are the angel the earth angel um you're the water bearer you give people knowledge life life force prana coming up again air you being an air sign intellect uh these people they hate it they absolutely hate it they want reversal for you these keep so this group of people could even want to see things to be reversed for you they don't like it they could be doing some things behind the scenes hidden enemies they're right they're close to you is what i heard say right close to you i don't right close to you so i don't know right if right resonates with you or close resonates but right close to you somebody wants to work on something with you again out of all their their choices they're choosing you aquarius they feel like you're the best uh option but they feel like this is the beginning of the end like you're not having them back you're not taking this back they don't know how to come back towards you they're in a in a energy of, of obsession now 
somebody is obsessed with the fact that you're shining you're getting everything that you actually the that you asked the universe for could be a father figure father of so they obsessed with the fact that it didn't work i heard it didn't work i don't know what they were doing we did have magic come out somebody was doing magic somebody was trying to do spells someone was trying to hold you back it didn't work. So they're really obsessed with the fact that it didn't work. Somebody could even been, have been paying practitioner to do some type of energy work. This person could have looked at your birth chart and tried to manipulate in that facet, in that way. Something did not work. Something did not phase you. They were waiting for it to work. They were watching you and waiting for it to work. I don't know if this person wanted you to die. They want a co complete calamity collapse for you. <sighs> whoa, 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 whoa. Tough. What do we, where do we want to leave the Aquarius? Um, let's see, we'll leave you with um, some roadmap cards. The Enchanted, the Enchanted Map Oracle. And I don't know all of the meanings of these cards. I'm trying to learn them. So I might have to look in the book. So this card comes Wizard, Wizard of Awareness. All right. So let's look it up. Uh, it seems like you know something, Aquarius. Like you, it's like um, the magician type of energy. You already know what's coming towards you. Yeah, mindfulness, being observant about what's going on in the world. And it talks about the, you know, with inside of you. You need to step into more of an observer position. It's going to give you a powerful perspective. Right now, you just have the capacity to see things clearly. Maybe that has been your prayer. It's like you... You're looking at the world differently. You have gained perspective for some of you. Some of you need to do this. You understand that nothing happening to you, happening around you, happening with you is personal. You understand that people come and go and experiences evolve from one state to another. You're just in a continual shifting and change. You are the wizard of awareness. So you're just aware of the energy around you, you know, um, so Aquarius is, uh, the Zodiac, uh, groups, friends. So you might sit in several different circles in, in your lifespan. Like maybe you won't always have, you know, the, the friends that you grew up with from, you know, elementary uh, school, you won't be as close or you don't have them in your life. Maybe you have a new set of friends, you know, maybe there has been a constant evolving or revolving, of, um, of uh, uh changing groups of friends that we did see join in so maybe some of you are going to join in meet new people and this is what maybe you're supposed to do maybe you were beating yourself up about the fact that okay people don't stick around for whatever reason whether it was you or them but maybe it's just the fact that you shouldn't take it so personal as the book says it's just that you're meant to sit in several different groups in your lifespan because you have something to offer the world with the queen of cups coming out and the star card. You got to understand that it's all good. Let it be. Watch a miracle unfold without any direct influence from you. Yeah, I told you just like the magician energy. Looks like you're going to get what you want, Aquarius. What have you hoping, wishing, praying for? You've done the work. You're doing the work. You're actually getting on the right Paid. Some of you are paying off things with the finance card. Let me pull one card from that. Um, getting your finances in order. Okay. Working backwards in terms of your finances. Um, making it right. Paying it forward. I don't know. Um, let's see. Finances. Two of swords wanting to flip and reverse. So it's um, upright. It is negotiation. It is coming looking at things and then saying i'll get back to it but it looks like now you're saying i gotta f fix this and finish it now and handle it now so you're handling things i 
I don't I think you understand that it's not up for negotiation with the ace of swords at the bottom of the deck. You just understand you need to make this change. You need to do it. Yes, it's gonna, you know, it's, it brings conflict maybe in your money because you gotta pay off old debts. But then you have victory because the ace of ace of swords says conflict before victory, before resolution. Yep. I knew it, the two of pentacles. So maybe it is going to cause a little bit of, you know, having to juggle, move money here, move it there, pay this. You're keeping everything up in the air. For other people, this will feel and look like it's stressful. But for you, you've got it. Yeah, you're going in so many different ways. But at the same time, you have a yes answer. It just might be delayed a little bit for you. And maybe even a large sum of money comes in unexpectedly to where it takes you to a new level. Um, it talks about with the four of pentacles, newfound wealth here, holding on tight to your money because you're trying to keep it too. Um, but also being very happy. Wow. Because you're in your life purpose and you found 10 of pentacles, long-term stability. Very nice. It's like you, you got serious about your finances. Okay. If your credit was messed up, we did have the devil out here, credit worthiness. You pulled the credit report, did what you needed to do in order to get it back to a, a, you know, a good standing. If you know that you owe this and owe that, you were paying things off, you were paying things on time. You just knew that you, it, you had to do the work. You couldn't just pray yourself out of bad credit. You had to do some work there and then let the universe help you match you where you are. Let a miracle happen. You do what is possible. Let the universe do the impossible. Okay. And for some of you, you did that and now you're about to see a miracle happen for you because you know, the universe is just really about matching energy because in this plane, it is all about, um, you still have, a what the word ex escapes me. You still have, a I can't even think of it. Anyway, you still have free will. There you are. You still have free will. You still can do whatever it is you do, you want to do. So the universe is not going to overtake overshadow your free will if you want to do something reckless you know the most the universe will try to do is really 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 prompt you to not do so but guess what you can still do it um so it's like if if in that scenario the universe won't overshadow your free will in terms of you wanting to do whatever it is you want to do right we'll, we'll take it to something realistic you want to eat a whole you want to eat a whole uh, tub of ice cream. You know you shouldn't do that, but you do it. The universe may be even whispering in your ear, we shouldn't do that. No, it's not good for us. You still do it. The universe isn't going to take the tub of ice cream out of your hand, put it back in the freezer for you, uh, tell you no, go back upstairs, go to sleep. No, it just doesn't work like that, right? So if you know that you have a real issue with back to a real world, uh, scenario credit worthiness the universe isn't going to go down to the credit bureau and wipe the slate clean for you and press the clean button for you so that your credit now is a one you have to do some work and then let the universe help you in the impossible space in the miraculous space but you have to do something first okay uh we ha we all have to do something uh, we don't want to fall into just running around and yelling the world, man, you know, yelling the word manifest, manifest. Like, you know, it, then it's no more than that, that prosperity gospel that used to be preached years ago. And we don't want to fall into that. On this channel, we have a saying, we do the work. Work is rewarded. So do the work. You'll get the reward. But if you're doing nothing, please expect nothing. So anyhow, Aquarius, you, you've done the work, you're doing the work, and it looks like the universe is bringing some uh, miracle into your life with no influence from you. Um, now you can rest hands off because they've, you've shown yourself approved and uh, the universe just wants to bless you. Miraculous uh, miracle. Don't be weary of these people doing all kinds of stuff behind your back. You're uh, super, super, super duper protected uh, because it's like the universe is preparing you Anyway, uh, the sun card wanted to fall out. Yeah, it's like the universe is shining down on you. The summertime may be very significant for you. You may be coming into the summertime of your life. So the summertime of anyone's life is a happy, abundant, joyous, fruitful um, 
time, right? Uh, that's what summer is about. So you may be coming into that period of your life here where it's a lot of playfulness. It's not a fun. It's not a happiness, joy. Maybe you were coming, you're coming out of the fall or the winter of your life here. And now you're coming into summer. So this is great. Aquarius, again, you may be coming into some, some money, opportunity for wealth. This is what this card says, opportunity for wealth. You still got to grow it, but it's opportunity for wealth. So uh, this is what I have for you. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. Let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. Maybe all of it didn't resonate for you, but let me know what part resonated for you down in the comment section. Also catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Uh, ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. Uh, this is what I have for you, Aquarius. Many blessings to you. Take care.